Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So, a lot's been going on for me recently. I've been extremely busy working on collaborations and long projects, and hopefully I will have some videos made soon uh, of all that stuff so that you can see what I've been up to. I'm also uh, delving into my prints. Uh, people have asked for copies of my work, and I'm also hoping uh, next year to be uh, involved in an art trail that's done locally where your work is displayed for a week or two uh, in a venue and people can come and look at it and buy prints etc. So um, I apparently am the first astrophotographer to, to try and uh, enter this so I'm really hoping they like my work and that I get accepted and it'll be really nice to show off some of the efforts I've been at for the last uh, year or so. So as I say, I've had loads going on and I've also made some purchases that I'm gonna be doing videos on. So I've done, uh, I've bought a new camera, which is the ASI 2600mm Pro, but that's not fully working yet because I'm still waiting for a filter wheel and filters to go with it. However, I have had a little play and more about that later. But a big, big purchase uh, that we've uh, done is we bought a camper van and this I am so excited about. So we are obviously planning some good camping trips, etc. But for me, it's going to be the Astro Bus. And I'm going to be driving this off to some dark sites for my astrophotography. Now I might need to make some mods to this van, like with the power and everything. It's got a leisure battery, but only one. So I think it might need more than one or, you know. But I'm going to obviously uh, look into all the things I can do to uh, make it work for me perfectly. Locally, I can get to maybe a Bortle 4 in about 30 minutes, so tonight is due to be clear. So I'm hoping to show you the van and take you out with me tonight, and let's see uh, if we can do some imaging and be in a little bit of comfort as well. So, um, thanks for joining me. Hope uh, you enjoyed the video. Um, let's go and have a look at this uh, Astro Bus. Here we are, we have a uh, Volkswagen camper van, or should we say Astro Bus. Um, it's uh, got all of the electrical connections we could want, although I think I will be extending it further. These are if you're at a campsite and you've got um, electrical hookup, otherwise it's 12 volt from a uh, leisure battery under the seat but I think if you add more leisure batteries and other systems it gives you a bit more uh, scope for plugging in so obviously ideally for me what would be great would be if I could actually run my rigs off of the leisure batteries in the van and then I wouldn't have to take separate ones but uh, we'll look into that but uh, it's all kitted out these two front seats here swivel 360 to give me a nice comfortable position when I'm uh, imaging if I didn't want to sit in the back here and this is a full double bed rock and roll bed which uh, is, is great we've got all nice lights in here and everything so it's fully kitted out and uh, I'll be honest I cannot wait to use it so tonight I intend to just chuck in here uh, my AZ GTI and my William Optics uh, Zenith Star 61 uh, and then I'm going to take it somewhere dark and hopefully get some imaging done we'll see how it works so I've um, just literally temporarily put in an inverter down there because uh, my laptop unfortunately the battery is um, well it's had better days and it has to be plugged in to be used so I think the leisure battery will be fine to support the uh, laptop and I'm going to bring my Skywatcher um, uh, power tank to uh, power the rig and the camera and uh, they'll be that'll be fine for that job so 
Um, let's hope that the forecast is correct and it's going to clear up and uh, we'll uh, be on the move later and we'll have a look at what we can grab. And of course, safety first before any uh, journey, make sure your precious ones are strapped in. Okay, so I'm here in the middle of nowhere and I'm going to set up, so I don't know how much you can see, but hopefully you can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to get my tripod open and then I'm going to find north. Just find the spreader. I'm going to just get myself set. See how good it is, eh? Okay, so um, I'm in the uh, camper van. It's still very cold outside, so uh, I'm all uh, woolly hatted and woolly gloved up. Um, I'm checking in on the uh, progress at home. I've got the uh, Google desktop uh, connected to my observatory at home. I'm taking some images on uh, NGC 1333 with the 2600, but as you can see there, I can show you, that's the vignette you get with a 1.25 filter and an APS-C uh, sensor. So I can't wait for my uh, 36 mil filters to turn up. I'm not sure how long they're gonna take, but uh, hopefully not too long. So, I'm just going to turn this light out, and what I'm hoping, if I spin you around, hopefully, you can see there, my main camera, and up there you've got a light, a little light up on the top there, which is my GoPro, and uh, we'll see whether or not it will capture them, but...
So I've just made uh, an adjustment to the camera and I've just upped the uh, exposure times to 15 seconds because I'm on the AZ GTI. So it's, uh, I haven't got it honed in or guiding. It's just tracking a bit like a Star Adventurer would. Um, and so 15 seconds, ISO 800, and uh, hopefully we'll get some uh, nice images. It's uh, not looking bad, but the batteries are really low on my intervalometer, which is a bit of a shame. So uh, I just have to keep an eye on that and see how it turns out. Right, I'm gonna have a coffee, I think. It's, uh, it's cold. So I've just finished my last bit of coffee. So next time I need to make more. Um, it's uh, coming up for midnight. Things are going really well. Uh, the subs are all coming in nicely on the camera. I'm hoping they're gonna be okay. Um, but a little while ago, I bought this, which is a 2.8 uh, 14 millimeter Samyang, which um, I've tried out a couple of times and uh, take some lovely pictures. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take the camera off of the uh, telescope and I'm gonna do a few shots with the uh, 14 mil and see what uh, kind of images I can get. Because it's a lovely dark sky. So uh, I'm gonna see what sort of shots I can get. So uh, I'll be back in a bit and uh, hopefully have something nice to show you. <laughs> 